Uh, <laughs> Hello, past Damien. It's the 6th of February 2022. Right, no, no, it's not been a good week. No, no, forward. It's not been a good week at all. There are a lot of people who like ask what does a PC in my unit do? And to tell you the truth, it's a really difficult question. 8 SIR. It's not the usual infantry chung swa up the hill platoon advance kind of shit and you don't really train for a tech. And I'm not sure exactly how much I am willing to explain it to you but the one word that gets thrown around a lot is the word manpower and I think that's the core concern in this battalion. More than any other thing it's manpower and to another extent morale. And this kind of feels like deja vu like I might have explained it before, just maybe six months ago. You won't really understand any of these concerns and what being a PC really feels like until you've really been in those shoes and it's not easy, I'll say that much. It's not easy by any means. The amount of busyness you are really comes down to a dice roll and if you're in charge of a camp where your troopers mount 24 hours, 7 days a week just like mine, then um, you have to be even more always ready, ready to strike on any day of the week, at any time, any moment. Just have that phone right next to you and make sure it's not on silent. You know it's gotten to the point where when I go out, I need to make sure that I have long pants and covered shoes and both of my camp passes in the event that anything occurs because you will never know when you need to go back to respond to any situation. I mean, on one hand, my platoon sergeant has it worse because he's the one who's supposed to be more on the ground than me. But on the other hand, I have been called back uh, on a Friday night to do some contact tracing because um, someone uh, came into close contact with a COVID positive case and subsequently went home at 2 a.m but it's all part of the job. And not to mention the absurd amount of contacts and messages and groups and communications that you have and need to be in the loop of and updating various people on various things. But like I said, it comes down to a die show whether, you know, nothing actually happens or shit hits the fan and all cylinders are fired etc etc and like I said you also won't know what it's like until you've been in those shoes so you're gonna go through a lot you're gonna go through ups and downs not just one cycle but several cycles and it's gonna be difficult but at the end of the day things need to be done someone needs to be there and someone needs to be the one to keep people in the loop so that's our job right now and it will be for the next Actually, I do have something optimistic to show you. So yeah, at least you have that to look forward to. But like I said last week, unit is nothing much like OCS and there aren't really a lot of things that you have learned which will be applicable right now. But I'll leave that to you to discover in about four months time. Meanwhile, enjoy the rest of your outfields and I'll see you next week.